Howdy, folks, and welcome to the show. For those who don't know, I am your trusty capadre this evening, your host, Matty D. Ugh. As always, we emphasize on the D. The little Naturally. D. Mm-hmm. Naturally. To the yeah, left, yeah. we got Mr. J. Uh-huh. Touch me in my special place. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh yeah. Please don't do uh, that Sorry, live. I'll take it back. And across the table we go to uh, everybody's not-so-favorite spice, ladies and gentlemen. We got the ginger. <laughs> hey. <laughs> And last but not least, let's give a warm welcome to our special guest tonight, making his show debut, ladies and gentlemen, Chris Mumpet. Yeah, Chris. Yeah. Woo! Thanks for having me, guys. Yeah, baby. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, we got a great show here tonight, so stick around because we are going to kick it off with a good old fashioned segment called Ridiculous News Headlines. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Nice, nice. After that, we are going to spin the wheel of shots and see whose panties come off first. Huh? I'm not wearing any panties. <laughs> uh, who, who probably is? not true. <laughs> no. It's probably not true. After that, we are going to go to a brand new game called What's Missing Here? And I'll explain more when we get there. And then Our we're going to close the show out with two things tonight. That's right. And also another brand new segment called Your Mind is in the Gutter. Uh huh. Nice. And our rightfully so special guest inductee, where Chris is going to put his name on Jugs Judy. She's, She's looking delicious. Right there. Today. She is. She, absolutely. You know what's funny about Jugs? Shelby's like, Jugs is looking like a kinky dom tonight. Oh, yeah, she is. <laughs> You're not wrong, oh, Shelby. You're not who's wrong. going home with Jugs? Or <laughs> she might be taking one of us home. We don't know. <laughs> Hugs Judy. She's taking all of us home, I guess. If one could be so lucky. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. They will have to wait and see. Everybody, stick around because we're going to kick it off right here, right now. Ridiculous news headlines, okay? Right. The uh-huh. world is full of awesome things. Obviously, the last couple of weeks have had some ridiculous news stories, and I found the best of Naturally. them. Okay, boys? What we're going to do, going to go around the table. Before we get to that, though, chat, I want to remind you guys, all hands on deck tonight. Every answer counts. We want everything in the chat. Help these guys out. Keep that in mind. Mr. J, the ginger, and Chris, Mm -hmm. ridiculous news headlines. We're going to spice it up. What I'm going to do for you guys, I'm going to give you a headline. That's all you get, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. What you got to do is do your best to guess what you think the story is going to be about. Now, these are actual news stories. They've happened out there. None of this is made up. Mr. J, I'll start off with you, chat. I want to know answers, what you think the story is about in chat. Ginger, you go next. Chris, you'll close this one out. Okay. Okay? Mr. J, the first one. We'll bring it up here just so everybody can see. Ridiculous news stories. <laughs> Number one is a zucchini my hiney. Oh, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> um, chat. All right, I got you. Mr. Got J's you. taking a sweet time. Chat, no, what do you I think you. it is? Mr. J, zucchini my hiney. What do you think the story's going to be about? I think it's someone shopping at a grocery store. And they fell, and a zucchini landed in their butt. <laughs> and that made the news. I hate yeah. when that happens. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? That's definitely something they, I would oh, see yeah. making the news. There just happens to be a news reporter there, too. You know, yeah. she has a camera. It's yeah. oddly so that headline, Mr. J's butt <laughs> gets smashed by zucchini. <laughs> oh, I'm in so much pain. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Ginger, let's go across the table to you. Everybody tuning in right here, right now. Ridiculous news headlines. All I'm giving these guys is a headline. They got to do their best to guess what it's going to mm-hmm. be about. Ginger, over to you. Zucchini, my hiney. <laughs> I'm going to think it's like a, a shoplifter, and uh, this person wanted the zucchini really bad, had nowhere else to put it, and right up their ass. Oh, oh they stole they, it. They yeah. Just, yeah. yeah. You go to extreme lengths to steal a zucchini. Right. Who that fucking was, steals that was a one zucchini? special You got to hide it in that prison pocket, man. <laughs> I picture it like being two people like, let's, let's steal a PS5. No, no, no. We're taking you want that zucchini. Put it in the butt. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? What's the worst thing you've ever stole? I'll tell you. <laughs> this one time, zucchini, straight up that ass, oh, man. Yeah. Whoa. No it way, hurt. bro. You didn't it settle so with good. a Snickers bar or something? No, it's all good. Wait till I tell you the story about the like watermelon. <laughs> let's go to our special <laughs> guest tonight, ladies and gentlemen, Chris Montpetit. <laughs> You have one headline. It's called Zucchini My Heine. What do you think the story is going to be about? I'm thinking some like old grandpa is too embarrassed to go to the sex toy shop. And <laughs> he's just like, you know what? I'm, I got something in my fridge that'll take care of this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. A little outside yeah. the butt there. Yeah. 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 I'm this. Yeah. Well, okay. it well. ends up inside eventually. Hey, po- po- points for improvisation, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is original. Yeah, ridiculous news headlines. Let's go over to chat right off the bat. We're going to go Jacqueline King. Okay, some guy had his angry wife shove a zucchini up his ass. Oh, yeah. Oh, up his arse. Yeah. 
Jonathan Myrang, someone was using a zucchini as a dildo and it broke <laughs> off in their ass. Oh, had to see yeah. the doctor to get it out. John, yeah. what's been up, there my man? Before, been there, yeah. Ed Clark, <laughs> shoplifting a zucchini in their <laughs> yeah. butts, yeah. obviously. Yeah, obviously. Let's go. Uh, we got somebody new in the house, Tyler. What's up, my man? What's he up, just Tyler? says What's LMFAO, up? boys. Yeah. Great, great group, by Dude, the look, way. Shannon, someone was passing cucumbers off as zucchinis or trying to until they got caught. Ooh, Ooh. Yeah. John Vanderhyde. What's up, my man? Smuggling on, vegetables into uh, prison. prison. Nice. <laughs> well done, All right. Missed that. There was a little cutoff there on that one. Okay. Ridiculous news headlines. The first one I gave you guys was zucchini, my hiney. Mm -hmm. Great yep. guesses. Unfortunately, everybody's completely wrong. But let's read Who it out. Guessed? A man in Wisconsin is under fire right now, okay, from a local grocery store for apparently sitting on crates of stacked zucchinis until they buckled and collapsed and destroyed the entire lot. <laughs> oh, my the God. The man fled the grocery store but was later found and is now pending charges. So uh, <laughs> how big was this guy to break the freaking crates? <laughs> <I know. laughs> Yo, he was somewhere what are the, around What are the crates there? made out of? Like yeah, they broke so the whole stack. Basically, it was a, a stack of zucchinis on crates, and he sat on the whole stack, and they all buckled and collapsed. Okay, let's be zucchinis honest. Zucchinis are very hard. Like, yeah. how... How heavy no, was this? This, this dude? is something I would do for sure. Like I go sit down at the store and break all those zucchinis. Hey, fatty, fatty, fatty. You don't break things. You drop things. Yeah, There's I drop them. I run into them. I freaking just screw them up. Completely. Woo! Yeah. Zucchini, my hiney. Ridiculous news headlines. Chat. Oh, thank you for the answers. We're gonna go move on. Next one, number two. Let's go over to the ginger. Bold my husband twice. What? That is what? a ridiculous news headline. Number two, <laughs> do your best to guess. Whatever comes to mind first, don't fry your brain. What do you think? Bold my husband twice. Chat, I know you guys <sighs> week to week got killer answers. What do you think it's going to be about, Ginger? Uh, I'm going to uh, think like it's a couple that uh, got in an argument and the wife uh, smashed a bowl over his head yep, once. Yep. And once the cops showed up to stop it, she, she did, it did it again. Oh, again. yeah. She yep. just Dude, eyewitnesses, but it was the police. That's oh, yeah. Right. This. That's right. Chris, let's go across the table over to you. Bold my husband twice. What do you think it's going to be hate about? hate when that happens. I, I got something similar, but instead of a bowl, she took the bowling ball. Oh. And, she went for the, and she went for the spare. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she, like, tied him to the yeah. bed with his legs open? She, like, gave him, gave him the bonk and then just gave him the... the Roll for the spare. Yeah, Roll for the right. spare. Got He's it. He's like, honey, I'm home. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. J, I bowled my husband twice. What do you think it's going to ah, be? Ah, fuck. Okay, I think it's um, the, you know, a couple that got a house, but they got a leaky roof, and she keeps putting a bowl on the floor to oh, get no. the water, and the husband trips in it twice. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Knocks a bowl over it. Loving the answers, I don't know why that'd be on the news, but... Ridiculous news headlines. All I'm giving these guys is a news headline. These are actual stories out there. Chat, in case you're wondering... They have to do their best to guess what the story's going to be about. Let's go over to chat, <laughs> see what everybody's saying. We got Ed Clark with wife smack the shit out of her husband with a bowl. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Eddie. And, uh, Shannon points out that he hopes or she hopes he was wearing a hard hat. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. That's what we got for chat for now. Yeah, I do want to say one that I've noticed uh, from the last one with the zucchinis. Uh, it's Matt Daddy with a zucchini in his pants. Oh, it's oh like I know. You had to backtrack <laughs> to point that out. Oh God, right. In case anybody's yeah. wondering. Who fucking it's said that? Megan, no, like taking, said a, that. taking a Tinder picture? That's like, yeah. Show off the goods? <laughs> That's a real zucchini, you know what I mean? Yeah. That's a real catfish right <laughs> there. He, he paid someone to put that in chat. He's like, here, 100 bucks, put that in chat. Yeah. Let's go one more. Jonathan Mayering, wife gets ready to win the bowling match. Husband tries to trip her up and gets him in the nuts and wins the match. All, all right. right, all right. We've like all been the, there. Uh, like in the wow, a couple of bowlers out there. All right. Dude, John wrote a novel. That's impressive. So <laughs> I do want everybody to pay attention on this one because Bold My Husband Twice is literally fucked. Okay. Oh, no. This one's wild. Jeez. It's lengthy, but it's good. All right. Stick with us. Let's do it. Ridiculous news headline was Bold My Husband Twice. A couple in Kansas City. Mm -hmm. All right. They were driving down Main Street when a bowling ball was thrown randomly <laughs> towards their car and lodged underneath the car. Okay? Jesus. Uh. The husband in the passenger seat exits the vehicle to attempt dislodging the ball from under the car. At this moment, a man approaches the car and attempts to rob the wife and take her purse. 
Okay, while she battles with the robber, she presses her foot on the gas and runs over the husband. Oh. Oh. She then, after running over the husband, she then puts the car in reverse and drives over the husband a second time. <laughs> then the suspect flees, and now the husband is in severe condition. Oh. Did, okay, <laughs> did, did the wife put the robber up to this? Like, you know, I got a yeah, good way we can take this my husband was planned, oh, right? oh, okay. <laughs> I feel right. like if I'm going to die, that's how my spouse is doing it. Oh, yeah. She I feel like after <laughs> after she runs him over the first time, she's like, oh, I'm so sorry, honey. Let me come get you. <laughs> He's still breathing back there. <laughs> yeah, like, oh, a random bowling that's ball was I... thrown under the car. <laughs> Who uses a bowling ball as a oh, weapon yeah. in, like, a robbery? So, basically, they're driving down the road all nonchalant, you know, talking about their day or whatever. A yep. bowling ball comes out of nowhere. She's like, oh, my God. <laughs> Gets stuck under the car. The guy gets out to go check on it. She gets robbed at that exact same mm-hmm. time. Drives over her husband. Realizes she drove over him. So then reverses <laughs> over. Goes him. over him again. Yeah. She's like, "It's okay, honey. We got car insurance." Do they like live in Gotham yeah. City or something? Like, is this like a failed Batman villain? Uh, probably. It could be. Ma- Megan's uh, with us too. Plan one thousand. Oh, it was a hundred yeah. thousand percent uh, plan. Bowling for dollars. Patty D, what's up, my man? Lair Eves, yeah. what's up, baby? Jesus, I was way off. Nah, you were close, Lair. Yeah. Shannon Young, I feel like there was. Was no suspect, and the wife just made that up to cover up the fact yeah. that she accidentally <laughs> ran over her husband. Oh, yeah, she's like, Well, what happened? Uh, dude, a bowling ball. Bowl. Uh, okay. and, and, someone hey, robbed me. We're gonna get you into the crime scene, baby. You're, yeah. I think you're on to something. We're gonna go number three, Chris. You're on the spot now, baby. Mm-hmm. Do your best to guess what the ridiculous news headline is based on what I give you. All right, gotcha. tell me what the story is gonna be about. Number three is the bear trip. Oh. <laughs> I think I think some poor suckers walking through the woods and does a face plant right into a bear trap. Oh, oh no, no. Not his hand. Yeah, yeah, just right oh. in there. Yep. You're God damn that dark. Is, yeah, that's, that's no good. Fucking splatter a lot. That's yeah. bad. Yeah. He's not staying ahead of the competition, <laughs> that's for sure. What? <laughs> Mr. J, <laughs> let's go over to you, Ginger. Close this one out. A bear trip. Uh, I think it's a couple. They go on vacation to a cottage, and then they go open the door of their cottage, and there's a fucking bear in there. Oh, And they got to no. run out. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Man, that would suck. Yeah, so a trip happens. to the cottage. We yeah. got one taking his complete head off in a bear trap. <laughs> yeah, he just Honestly, went full dark side. You know what's crazy is all these scenarios actually are probably legit, and they probably mm-hmm. have happened at oh, some I'm point. Sure. I'm sure somebody has landed them. That themselves. guy's never going to be the head of a major corporation. <laughs> that's for sure. <laughs> Listen, I got to say, you're a musician. Oops. You must be really into that trap music. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I got Yo, you. No, chat. Yeah, what do you guys think the story was about called The Bear Trap? Oh, we got some good answers. Chris Malpati and Mr. J have already said there's Ginger. Close this one out. We're going to go over to chat. All right. Uh, I'm going to say it's uh, some people being chased by a bear, and uh, the other person just trips it, trips someone and oh. says, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, trips them trips off the them gate. So yeah. they can get away. As yeah, long like, as you're not, they're like best friends before yeah, that. Like, yeah. If you're first, you're not last, right? <laughs> right. I see what you did there. Yeah. You sick son bitch, you. Yeah. All right, so let's go over to chat, Mr. We J. got some great Read answers. A couple out. What do we got? Tyler's got acid trip in the woods meets a bear trap. Very Yo, what's, up? what's up, Tyler? Yeah. Welcome to the show, Tyler. baby. Ed. Oh, Ed, anal raped by a bear on a camping trip? Oh, oh like, Eddie. I'll take the, the bear bear's trap. like, I could eat you, but, you know, I'll just fucking rape you. Yeah. I'm not taking yeah. Ed with me on any trip. John man. says, trips over a bear and lands head first in another bear's ass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Pat Deneau, a couple out for a nice walk in the woods, then come back in the car and guess what's in the back seat of bear? Holy shit. Uh-huh. Answers. A couple went on a trip to see bears. Turned out to be a naked resort trip. <laughs> Yo, oh. Trevor Dunn, what's up, my man? Oh. A bear ate magic mushrooms I'm with and me. tripped right out. Okay. I'm with Maggie. And on this one, too, it's a panda falling over because I can relate. Yo, we're going to go one more here. Gary Cheryl O'Rourke, what's up, Daddy O? When you smoke some bear shit. Yeah. (laughs) Yo, nobody's smoking bear shit, man. This is the 70s? (laughs) This isn't we. What is For everybody tuning in right here, right now, we're doing some ridiculous news headlines. These are stories out there that I've collected. They are ridiculous. This is all in the last couple weeks. The Mm -hmm. world's a great place. It's like my playground. So. Number three was the bear trip. Great answers, everybody. Let's read it out. An Alaskan woman was met with great surprise returning home from getting groceries on Saturday, okay? Mm -hmm. 
While walking up to the door with her hands full and her vision partially blocked, she did not notice a massive black bear sleeping on her front porch and completely tripped over him. Oh, my God. Oh. Startling the bear, she screams and runs inside to call WLR, so Wildlife Rescue. Uh-huh. The bear, on the other hand, starts eating her groceries. <laughs> <laughs> the bear's like, sweet, I get to nap. There's people bring Guys, me food. Guys, tell me right now. Imagine, right? Everybody holds their groceries in front of their face. Oh, yeah. You know, they kick the door closed. Yeah. They're walking up to the house, and all of a sudden, you trip over a fucking bear. Yeah, of all things to trip on, like yeah. a fucking how, bear. How, yeah, yeah, how do you not see a bear? Like yeah. they are so massive. How do you? It's not like he said. Just, she must. She said, she's like, yeah. I'm doing one trip. Yeah. I'm, yeah. Not, yeah. I'm not going multiple. And her vision was partially blocked, not noticing a bear sleeping maybe, on her maybe porch. Maybe it was nighttime. You're right. The all bears fucking huge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's not like it's flat or anything. So. I don't know. Between a bear tripping over you, I'd probably just be just as scared. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's pretty much the same thing, right? Wildlife I, rescue. I you come back it. outside. I'm eating your groats. Like, yeah. <laughs> they blow dirt you. They show up and shoot one of those up. <laughs> <laughs> shoot him in the ass. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. J's like, ah. Uh, uh. yeah. <laughs> Chat, we got one more here to go. We're going to spin the wheel of shots. Party's just about to get started. Chat's doing killer already, so let's get it going. Ridiculous news headlines. Uh-huh. Mr. J, back to you. Number four, do your best to guess what the story is going to be about, okay? Last mm-hmm. one is called. Hunk of burning love. Uh, <laughs> this is when Matt Daddy went to the gay bar and got rejected by everyone. Hey, that only happened yeah. once. Second time I was accepted. Yeah. <laughs> Digging the answer. Hunk of burning love. MD to the gay bar and gets rejected. Yeah. That that does sound like a story oh, that would happen. Man. For sure. Just my luck, too. For sure, bud. You know what? It's yeah. the Sanchez stash, man. It's not that <laughs> big of a deal. Ginger, <laughs> let's go over to you. Hunk of burning love, baby. What do you think the story's going to be about? Uh, a couple making love with uh, candles all lit around them and uh, <laughs> oh, candles no. fall over. And no. <laughs> hunk of burning Man, love. Like it's really hot. Hey. It's really hot. Uh huh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Slim baby. Slim baby. <laughs> Step on. Step on. Hunk of burning love. Across the table we go. Our special guest tonight, Chris Montpetit. Tell me what you got for hunk of burning love, baby. I think we're on the same way. I'm thinking like it's a stripper though. I mean, you get like all oiled up for like the strip oh, show. Oh, she catches yeah. on too close. Oh. Too close. <laughs> Too close well, to the candle for that like sexy light, right? That's the same broad that got her head stuck yeah. in a bear that's trap, right. isn't it? The dude's like, oh, this chick's on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking right. That's how you end up looking like Jugs. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Jugs oh. would definitely be the one to oil herself up. Let's not stop, you know, ignore the fact that Jugs got a boob job. Yeah. 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 No, Good work, she's looking, looking absolutely she great. Not, she not bad. Let's go to chat. Our last one was Hunk of Burning Love for Ridiculous News Headlines. Jacqueline King... Uh-huh. Oh, she's got That's an answer for the last one. A couple went on a trip to see bears turned out to be naked resort trip. Ooh, got yeah. you on the last yeah. one. Uh, let's go, Megan, oh, the wife that failed to kill her husband by running him <laughs> over twice. She gets sick of it and sets yeah. the house yeah. on fire. Yeah. Megan, you sick Oh, that's a good you. point. She's like, this motherfucker's still alive. <laughs> I ran over him twice. Let's Talk go, about Jonathan Myrick, a couple making love after eating spicy food and couldn't make it to oh. the bathroom. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, baby. Jeez. What's up, John? Larry Eves. Yep. My man. Same line of Blair. gingers, but a couple in a tent making love, and things get a bit wild, and they roll over the fire pit. Oh, oh. you know what, dude? That's... Loving these answers. Chat's killing it. You guys man. are so creative. I pr- give props to you. Holy Absolutely shit. Absolutely loving it. Let's go one more. Tyler, welcome to the show again, my man. He Tyler. says... Didn't do a good enough job with the wife, so she let your ass up. That's right, Tyler. Can relate. Yes, can relate. Can relate. Let's go number four so we can get over to the wheel of shots. Hunk Dude. of burning love. A Florida man is being charged for setting his now ex-girlfriend's house on fire while oh. she was sleeping at his house. Oh, okay. What? In questioning, the man stated that their love runs deep and she didn't need her own house anymore because his house was plenty for the both of them. <laughs> That's what I call a hunk of burning love, right? <laughs> I'm sure there's not any other better way to solve this problem. Yeah, no. <laughs> she doesn't need her own house yeah. because she's staying with me now. This is some guy that's just like so anxious. He's like, I don't know how to ask her. I got a great idea. Yeah. I'll just burn, burn her house down. down. She <laughs> has to live with me now. Yeah. No choice now. Yeah, I love insurance says, will cover it. A Florida man is being charged for setting his now ex-girlfriend's oh, house. Yeah. Like, of course. You burned her house down, bro. <laughs> yeah, why'd you burn my house down? I was doing you a favor. Yeah. You know, we live together now. Just for now love. You don't, you don't have to live there. Now you you live always with said me. you wanted out of your lease. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see Isabel's answer? No, Isabel. <laughs> it's a couple having a long, wild sex night that started a fire just from banging her. <laughs> <laughs> I got some burn. hard friction. Isabel. Isabel. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hey, everybody. Uh, Welcome to the show. Jamie McConnell says rub. What's up, Ever G- mix up Vic Vapor Rub instead of lube? Oh, oh you know yeah. what? Jeez. I've heard that in horror movies, man. Uh, <laughs> I've heard of people do doing that. it with hot and cold accent, too. Like, they put some oh, hot and cold, and then they jerk hey. it by accident. Man, that's it's hours not, of agony. That yeah. is a hunk of burning love. And chat, Absolutely. guess what? Killing the answers, boys. Really showing you guys up here tonight. I think Chris mm-hmm. is doing a stellar job. Ginger, Mr. J, pull your fucking socks up. <laughs> I'm, so, Why? I'm sorry, my lord. It's all right. We got the old wheel of shots coming up. So, Excellent. ladies and gentlemen, let's bring up the wheel. For those tuning in nice. for the very first time, what you're going to see on your screen is a wheel. All four of us is on it. Touche. What's going to happen here tonight is the wheel's going to spin. Whoever it lands on has to do a shot, okay? Since I love my new guest here tonight, he gets to choose which shot we have to do. Uh, Okay, that's the rule tonight. Chris, power is in your hands. Ladies and gentlemen, before we get to spinning, let's get to finding out what we're drinking, right? So let's bring him out uno momento right here. Oh, dear. Shot number one, we got mango... Somebody help me out. That's a ra- raspberry Bacardi. Raspberry? Yeah. yeah. Ooh, we got raspberry yeah. Bacardi. Yeah. Number two. This one's pretty cool. I like this shot. <laughs> you would. We got Pussycat. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you would. <laughs> Look at the colors on that. That pussycat. actually looks delicious. Yeah. And sh- every show, we like to throw a trick shot. I like me a good Pussycat. <laughs> Tonight's trick shot really <laughs> sucks. So we're going to bring it out right here. It's called the Sweaty Mexican. Lair, we love you. Have a good night at work. That's yeah, at work. good night at work, Lair. We got a swexy, sweaty, 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 sweaty. sweaty. We yeah. got a swexy medican. Swexy's got to be a new word. <sighs> sweaty Mexican. This has fireball, tequila, mayonnaise, and hot sauce all mixed together. <laughs> this looks like fucking that is <laughs> shit in the cup. A fucking nasty. It's in the titty man. glass. So three shots tonight: sweaty oh, Mexican, shit. the pussy oh. cat, and the raspberry Bacardi. Ooh, it's got look chunks. At that. Ugh. Look at that. So, Sexy. without further ado, my man Chris, you tell us what shot we take. You also tell me when to stop. All let's right. go. Yeah. Woo! Let's go. Uh huh. And stop. Oh. Mr. J, what shot would you like Mr. J to we're, do? We're friends, right? We're friends. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't do it, man. I don't feel like it. he's going to maybe take it easy uh, on you, or he's just going to bust it uh, out. He's going to give you the pussy. Nah, let's, let's, let's go to the Bacardi. Yeah. Oh. yeah. That's my man right there. Thank you. Nice. Bacardi, woo, Mr. That J. A boy. Oh, that's good. Oh, we're all getting fired up. Let's go. Damn, that's good. I like that. Shot number two, Mr. J. Tell me when to stop. I'm not looking. And stop. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get to tell me. I tell when, myself. You know what? Tell you what. For that, he deserves. <laughs> you can stop for me whenever you want, man. <laughs> you sound bitch. You motherfucker, sound bitch. Ah, let's see how me and Chris have fared so let's, far. Are we let's, on? let's just leave the last one to fate, and we're, you're all getting yeah. the pussy cat. Pussy cat. Here we go. So, in this case anybody's fun. wondering, <laughs> he stops the, before the pussy cat <laughs> shot is the watermelon vodka and pina colada rum. Wow, that sounds great, man. Doesn't sound too bad. Let's fire it up. Mm-hmm. You gotta love when you gotta take off the rain. That sounds beautiful. <laughs> Looks like there's milk in there. Man, this is gonna give me a hunk of burning love after this, <laughs> or a big juicy shit. Mm. How was that? Wow, you know what? Flavorful. Not bad, yeah, I bet. Punched in the mouth with a coconut mixed with a rum. Wow. <laughs> okay, chat, we got one more to go for the Wheel of Shots, and we're going to go to a brand new game called What's Missing Here. Oh. I'll tell you guys how it works after this. Chris, tell me when to stop, my man. Oh, fuck. Who's getting the worst one? The sweaty Mexican. Woohoo! Who's it going to be? All right, stop. Oh, oh yes. Mr. J. Yes. Fuck. Fucking smart man. Woo. Dude, look at how full this thing is. Yeah, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, he's drinking a sweaty Mexican. It's so thick. Let's okay. read some chat. What is everybody oh, saying? Shit. Lair, back to work. Oh. We're going to miss you, my man. I'm just going for it. Patty D, I'm having a oh. shot with you guys. Water oh. and more milk. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> oh. We got Jonathan. Oh, give that ginger God. some Mexicana. Oh. That was the worst one I've ever done. Spicy coagulated (laughs) shot of nightmare sauce. Will you need a spoon for that? Who thought of that? Dude, it was was horrible, but the end tastes like cinnamon hearts. (laughs) (laughs) That's crazy. Not bad. bad. Not bad. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to move on to a brand new game right here called What's Missing Here? Let's bring it up for everybody. What's Missing Here? Here's how it works. Okay, boys, we're going to go around the table. Mr. J, as always, I'll start with you. Chat. You guys are in on this as well. We can't do it without you. Mr. J. Yes. 
the ginger and Chris, my man, a mon petit, you right, baby? Yeah, man. Hey, so, baby, baby. What we're gonna do? What's missing here? What I've done is I've collect collected really random and weird pictures, right? Mm -hmm. But what I've done is segregated a section of that picture and eliminated it. What you guys have to do is try to guess what is in the picture, what's missing <laughs> from the picture, okay? okay? Gotcha. Whatever you can do, try to guess Excellent. what's missing yeah. from the picture. Chat, you guys as well. We'll go around the table. Mr. J. Very excited. Picture Very number excited. one. Do your best to guess what's missing here. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, Chad, I want to know all answers. What is missing in this picture? I think it's some dude <laughs> sitting in a suspended desk. <laughs> 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 Some dude sitting in a suspended desk. Know, yeah. So I'll give you guys a little hint and a little uh, <laughs> assistance, a little advice. The black parts are what is missing from the picture. Okay? Oh, there's so, more. Okay. So just so, just so you know. The black parts. I'm weird. still going with the dude sitting yeah, in the desk. Yeah, dude sitting in the desk. Yeah. Let's go across the table to the ginger. Chat, help these guys out. What do you think is missing from the picture? Yeah. Ginger, let's go over to you. What's missing here? Uh, I know that's your bedroom, so that's got to be the sex swing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like a slingshot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a guy sitting in a suspended desk, my sex room. Chris Malpa, T, what do you got over there, my man? Yeah, What's yeah. missing this, in this picture besides a ladder? This is like one of those baby jolly jumpers. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like a, a jolly jumper for adults or yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you got someone that's Ugh. just like sitting there waiting to be like launched up. <laughs> into, the, into the floor. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's go over to chat. We got some people. Shelby, one of those uh, times Mr. J is going to puke on set. Shelby, oh, I, was, yeah. I was damn close, <laughs> let me tell you. Michelle Kramer, sex swing. I like it, girl. Welcome yep, to the show, yep. by the way. Chico, my Chico, man. Chico, woo. Nice. Handcuffs, that's exactly what's missing in this picture. Yeah. <laughs> Some kind of creepy dungeon. <laughs> we Jamie, got tons of sex a naked dude in sex swing. Sex swing. Shelby, can we play with that? Hey. Oh, hey what? Unless oh. I'm invited. Oh, Megan's asking <laughs> Shelby yeah. if they can play. Tyler, oh. a guy in a straight jacket and mask. Ooh, it's like a prison. Yeah. Someone propping up their ceiling fan while it's broke. <laughs> 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 this is so overly complicated. So, loving the answers. That's how it's going to work. We got a few of these to go, and then we have a sweet live chat challenge coming up after this Noice. okay so let's get through it everybody remember their guesses what's missing here let's check it out it's definitely a ladder but it's a guy with stilts <laughs> what? <laughs> what the yeah. <laughs> but why though but why what though? is he but doing why? Yo, like practicing his giraffe all cosplay. i know yeah this guy literally picked the most isolated and <laughs> empty room to do this in. uh can someone help me down <laughs> he looks <laughs> like he's stuck <laughs> Oh, yeah, what if it's like a form of torture? Like, you just, yeah, good luck getting out. Yeah, dude, they, they fucking strapped his ass to this. It's like a, like that scene in Austin Powers when they they park the little yeah. thing in there. He's like, oh, I, I, mis, I miscalculated That's this a good point, size. guys. I'm thinking, like, if you were setting this up to practice, this is the most inconvenient <laughs> spot to practice. Go outside. Dude, literally, you can't move <laughs> no. other than going closer together. What set of stilts do you take off first? Yo. Can you? <laughs> I love looking over at chat, and I see Megan saying, what in the fuck? <laughs> I'm actually kind of jealous that looks fun oh, <laughs> megan. <laughs> megan what if we all did a race with those you got a race with them <laughs> great is it a better view oh, tyler how did he get up you're absolutely right trevor how did he get up one. that's what my wife asked me let's go number two across the table to ginger chat we got these all night long baby let's go number two what's missing here oh you can't see wow uh, you know what? i wonder what's We're missing, gonna, yeah, what was missing? The boat. it was a fucking boat let's go <laughs> number three double click i'm going with the train What's missing here? Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's a trick question. I have no doubt. Yeah, it is. Everybody take a look at this one. What's missing here, Ginger? Over to you. What do you think it is? Uh, them looking at a picture of Mr. J naked. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what? Uh, that whole black section there, it's yeah. definitely Mr. J's naked right yeah, yeah. there. That's my dick. <laughs> oh. Chris, let's go over to you. What is missing from this picture? It's got to be Meg. Uh, <laughs> it's gonna wait. be Meg. He's getting literal yeah. on. I'm loving this. Shut up, Meg. Shut up, Meg. We got chat. Chat, you guys are coming up. For those tuning in for the first time right here, right now, we're playing called What's Missing Here. I've added a bunch of random ass pictures, took in a section of them out. They gotta guess what's in the picture. Uh -huh. Mr. J, let's go over to you. What's missing from this picture? I think it's Mr. J and Ginger. Oh, oh. So, yeah. I think it's both you, of us. You're both not naked, right? Oh, well, obviously we're naked. <laughs> well, I don't know. We, normally when we do that, we break the cameras, so we yeah. must have clothes on. Yeah. So just to recap, we got Ginger stating that it's Mr. J naked. Yeah. You're going with the classic Meg, Meg like yep. your style. And Mr. J's thinking 
Mr. J and the ginger <laughs> probably doing some <laughs> love in there. We're, We're just fucking love. in the picture. What's Chad hunks. got? Chad's saying what's missing. Gary says water. <laughs> Yo, oh, for the yeah. last one. Yeah. Yeah. He's holding up the light until the contractor comes back. Jonathan from the last one. Yeah. A pool of puke mm-hmm. and bottle of... Ipecac? Ipecac. What the fuck is Ipecac? It makes you throw up. Oh, that that yeah. Yeah. Well, that's what they drink in the actual episode. Yeah. yeah. yeah I got you. Wow. So let's do this one. We got a couple more here to go, and we're going to get over to our live chat challenge. What's missing from here, naturally, to make everybody puke in a room would be Ginger's face. Ah. <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> yeah. It's funny because you yeah, brought him food says, too. Fuck yeah. Yeah. It's dude, my cooking being, that does it. You were being so nice. They looked at you and then I don't know what <laughs> Could happened. you imagine? Like, I probably got some food. <laughs> 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 I didn't think it was that yeah. bad. Wow. What's missing here? I believe we have one or two more here to go. Let's go over to our special guest tonight. Killing it so far, by the way, Chris. Thank you. My man, you got to do your best to tell me what's missing here. Chat, help him out. What's missing here? <laughs> oh, oh what the? It's a, it's, it's definitely like Kermit the Frog sitting on a chair again, oh, like his lap dance fuck. from Miss Piggy. Oh, Miss Piggy giving him that dirt. <laughs> yeah, right? she giving him that dirty. Yeah, I like it. He's he's definitely hermiting. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys are dangerous. You know that? <laughs> Come on, am I the only one fucked up here? Or are you guys too? Let me know in the comments. Well, I've actually got two brows on. It's great. Mr. J, let's go over to you. What's missing here? Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm going. Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs> no, no. Rosie O'Donnell and Vin Diesel. Yeah, that's Ooh. my answer. <coughs> Rosie O'Donnell oh, and Vin Diesel. Geez. Perfect. Ginger, let's go across the table to you. What's missing here? A butcher in a dominatrix suit. <laughs> oh, dude, that's kinky as fuck. That's next Ginger. level kink. Ginger. Starting to throw out Isabel answers. Mm. You got like a Swedish chef? <laughs> <laughs> let's uh, let's go over to chat here. Ooh, Ed, we love you, my man. Take her easy. He's got to go until next you, week. Yep. Shannon Young says the glory hole. Jonathan Kermit getting his ball stomped on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Freezing. 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 All right. No, Anyone nice else freezing? Oh, like we got there's a chat freezing. Oh, yeah. we're just freezing oh. again. Great. Are we freezing, everybody? Yeah, let us know if we're freezing. We'll, well uh, let's we'll give it a couple the minutes stream. and then uh, we'll see. Hold on, Matt, Ginger, and Mr. J. No, we're still getting. Yeah, we're still, still getting. Them. They're there. They're there. I'll find out. If, we'll keep going and uh, I'll find out for freezing. Kermit dresses yeah. a pimp. Okay, we got one more to go after this. Uh, what's missing here? Just to recap, we got Vin Diesel. Oh, Vin Diesel and Rosie O'Donnell. Rosie O'Donnell. Yeah. You said uh, a dominatrix. Butcher. Yeah. Butcher. Yeah. And what was your answer there? Kermit the Frog. Kermit the Frog. Sitting on his chair. What actually was missing here was just a wedding. Oh. <laughs> Who has that at the yeah. fucking wedding? That's... <laughs> yeah, no. No, I hear you, man. Yeah, holy shit. Who's, uh, who's dressing up like sexy Miss Piggy What at if the that is the bride's outfit? <laughs> Oh, oh, dude. Dude, the dude's dressed up like Kermit. That's, that's the new mother-in-law. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's been a long time since I've been to a wedding, and I don't remember it looking no. like that. Woo, dude, Larry. Ginger, if that's what your mother-in-law wears, you, you fuck, man. Everybody's saying we were freezing, but we are good to go now. Sorry about YouTube that. YouTube is good. Chat is good. What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Sorry about the freezing. Thanks for the step. support, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. So apparently what was missing from this picture is whoever's dressing up as sexy Miss Piggy at a wedding. That's for oh. sure. You know, as much as we're, you know, making fun of it, I would totally go to that wedding. If I can see Miss Piggy in a Donna Matrix. Like, yeah, dude. She's dude. wearing two bras, man. Yeah. And a big it's old fucking titties. dude. Honestly, she kind of looks. She Twice got those, as much milk. It's she got those thick. big old hips. She don't have milk. <laughs> yeah, there's like, she's like thick. kids around and a bunch of creepy dads looking at her. Like, damn, girl. Her and Jug should hook up. That's all I'm saying. I we got so. one more here to go. We're hey, gonna move pork. on to the live <laughs> challenge. Oh, Ginger, son of a bitch. Stop it. <laughs> here we go. Let's actually close this one out with Chris tonight. What's missing here? Do your best to guess what you think it is. All right. What's missing here? Oh, mm, yes, of course. <laughs> Jeez. What? <laughs> That's MacDon's, baby. John Elba Mel, what do you think's missing here? Oh, man. <laughs> it's a nice skyline, so there's there's got to be, like, uh, just, in, like, an advertisement saying, like, eat at Burger King. Oh, oh like a plane. Oh, yeah. <laughs> eat at Burger King. Yeah. I like, like the creative points there. That's good. It's Mr. Creative. J, let's go over to you. Ginger, close this one All out. Right. What is missing here? Uh, Mr. J on top of the sign eating chicken nuggets. Oh. Just, I'm sitting up there on the... Yep, eating Mr. Mr. I'm J. eating Mr. J. <laughs> <laughs> He's up there. No. Uh, I mean, I'm up there eating chicken nuggets. Loving it. Ginger across the table over to you. Chat, you guys are closing this one out tonight.
right. What's missing in this picture? Let me know, Ginger. Uh, UFOs. UFOs. Ooh. Nice. Oh, so we got good. drive-by plane with the sweet banners that always insults people. Mm-hmm. I love those banners. Mr. J eating himself <laughs> and <laughs> UFOs. Dude, chat, chat's got some great answers. Two people, Megan and Shannon, both say, all your faces drooling over chicken nuggets. <laughs> A guy planking, Trevor. <laughs> A guy planking. Oh, yeah. And oh. Shannon says there's a dick written in the clouds. Oh, that oh, would be wow. so yeah. clever. Patrick Dano, what's up, Dad? Uber driver ran into the pole. Okay. Well, okay. <laughs> have to uh, fix the uh, what are they on the top? Are they in the sky? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Shannon Young. It's a flying car. The, the WAP wet ass pork. Oh, <laughs> oh, that, Shannon. Hey, can relate. <laughs> and Jonathan, what's up, my man? Ronald McDonald dropping a deuce like a bird. Okay. Yeah, all right. All right. Digging That's the gangster. answers, everybody. Let's check it out. Close out. What's missing here? We're going to go do a sweet live challenge coming right up for the chat. Let's do it. What's missing here was. And the closest person was Mr. J, but this really? guy. He was. I like, was the guy blanking. <laughs> <But> this guy. <laughs> That's Trevor. Trevor. Way to go, Trevor. Trevor. Dude, Kill imagine, baby, imagine you're going through the drive through You're like, what, what the, the fuck, fuck is that? that? So he either had like a, I don't know, it was like a, a reach truck or something brought yeah, him up there, a goddamn crane or something, but. Parkour. Yeah, parkour. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He climbed, he climbed, climbed the trees just to get up there. <laughs> yeah, this, guy's, this guy's definitely the two humper, though. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Fuck, that looks good. Okay, we're going to move over to our sweet live chat challenge. This includes everybody out Ooh. there. I'll tell you what, guys. You want to see something sweet tonight? Mr. J is going to get pelted with water balloons <laughs> right on the show. Me, Ginger, and Chris are going to throw mm. them at him. Unless yeah, you guys don't hit our threshold, okay? So Ooh. tonight's goal, if we can get 20 likes and 10 shares on you this video it. tonight, 20 likes, 10 shares, we're going to destroy Mr. J with a shit ton of water balloons. I like getting wet. And you guys are going to love seeing that. <laughs> 20 likes, 10 shares. He gets destroyed. Chat, this only happens if you guys want it to. So yeah, smash yeah, the like button, smash the share button. Let's get it going. Once we hit enough, Mr. J will let us know, and we will do the challenge, okay? Excellent. While we're waiting on chat, though, I do got some things I want to discuss. Uh-huh. Oh, no. There is a lady out there. Her name is Heather Sommer, okay? Okay. You. And she submitted this thing. To us, uh, it's called Every Podcast Has the Same Three Hosts, okay? <laughs> and when I was looking at our group, I was like, damn, uh-huh, man, yep, this yep. looks pretty good. So let's let's bring it up. And big shout out to Heather, by the way, if she's out there watching, because all podcasts <laughs> have the same three people hosting it. Oh, yeah. And, it, and it's so true, because Absolutely. clearly I'm the guy with the dirty Sanchez. Yeah. We got, oh, yeah. Uh, the, the ginger, naturally, and I guess you're the... the Bald, the f- oh, guy. dude, I'm Bully the guy that's got guy. fucking... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I got cheesy With dust all over my hand. Yeah. <laughs> that totally does yes. look like you, Mr. Hey, guys, you want to see my Woody doll? The, the problem is, Matt, people. is that guy can actually grow a mustache, but... Yeah. Hey! No. Come Shots on. fire. Hey, Chad, come on now, man. It doesn't get any more dirtier than this. You know what, though? Kuda, big shout-out to Heather. And, hey, rightfully Heather. so, everybody, if you got shit to send us, let us know and send it away because we will air it live. On it is amazing right. how accurate that is. <laughs> yeah, that's so great. Yeah, the same. Uh, the podcast has the same three people hosting it. Oh, we'll yeah. throw a little picture of Chris Mapati up in there, though. Eh? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, buddy. Yeah. With... Uh, speaking about podcasts, though, I do want to give another big shout out to a uh, guy oh. who's sitting in the building tonight. Who, who, Ladies guys. and gentlemen, we got Chris Mopati in the house and he actually runs and hosts his own podcast. So what we're going to do, no we are going to bring up Chris's podcast. Let's get gaming. Yeah, podcast. And we're going to talk about this for a little bit. Yeah. Waiting on a chat challenge. Chris, this is your podcast. You are yeah. the host. One of them. One of the hosts. Yeah. Uh, tell us a little bit about what, what what is this podcast all about, my man? So uh, my friends and I, we uh, we actually had a previous podcast uh, where uh, I mostly did the editing, and now I'm more involved in this one. And uh, we just talk about video games and video game news and reviews and nice. interviews. Yeah. Just mm-hmm. basically anything to do with gaming, right? Gaming and entertainment. Like and it's honestly, man, that's huge, huge. Um, 
top it. Like, oh, it's dude, huge. Yeah. streaming and yeah. shit. Yeah. Like, so much. Huge now, man. In, in my opinion, gaming is probably going to take over the world someday. Gaming so. is yeah. like one of the biggest things right now, especially when it comes to like esports and like oh, yeah. it's yeah. even well, breaking into movies. Everyone's like, stuck getting... inside right now, too, so they're all gaming. And Sad we got... as it is, it sounds crazy, but gamers can make more money than like a doctor or a oh, lawyer. Oh, it's crazy. Right? So yeah. gaming is obviously the future. Like some of the, some of the most biggest earners right now on like the internet are people that are just playing Fortnite. Oh, yeah. Nice. Oh, yeah. Nice. So, uh, how long you guys been doing this for? Uh, we're about, I want to say, for like four four months in now. I think uh, we're on like really? our thirtieth episode or thirty Damn. Or second. Damn. Damn. Hey, we've yeah, got a couple special episodes. Good so, job. ladies and gentlemen out there, this is Chris Montpetit, and he's uh, a co-host on this podcast. Let's get game. And if you guys are out there interested in stuff like this, definitely check this guy out. Uh, where can they find links or so anything to find this? If you wanna you wanna find us, you can find us on whatever you get your podcast or uh, just search up Let's Get oh, Gaming, or nice. you can you can hop on our. Twitter is uh, Let's GG Podcast. Oh, so, that's right. good. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, so on the main ones, like Apple Podcasts, yeah, uh, Spotify, yeah, we're, whatever, on a, right? we're on a site called Anchor, uh, Anchor FM, and uh, they actually like sponsor the podcast and like uh, they do all the hosting and stuff like that. Nice. Cool. To anywhere wow. you can that's get your awesome. podcast. So there's, right. there's sites I've never even heard of that we're on. So for those wondering too, I do have a link in the description of this live broadcast right now directed to his podcast. If you want to go check yeah. it out. Hey, right. uh, big shout out to Chris Mopati. Uh, guys killing it Chris, with his podcast. If you like that stuff, interested in the gaming stuff, Good Hey, job, check man. it out. Right. Uh, appreciate we'll, it. Like Mr. J said, we'll have his links and stuff in the description. Yeah, so it, Chris, man. big cheers. Let's give it up. Yeah. Let's get gaming, baby. Yeah. <laughs> We I, are going to quickly check on our live chat challenge. How oh did we yeah. do? These people want to see me get oh, hit by some water balloons. Oh, oh, Mr. Jay gets smashed oh, by yeah, water yeah, balloons. Yeah, yeah. People are ducking out right now. All For right. those who've stayed, it's about to get good because I'm getting my pitching arm oh, ready. Well, I got to get ready. Mr. J, let's get in the zone. Ladies and gentlemen, look at this. Let's raise them up, boys. We got buckets, Ooh, okay. buckets of water balloons. We're gonna pelt this motherfucker. I was a pitcher <laughs> yeah. once, so I'm just here. We go. Giving you a warning. All right. Uh, who wants to throw first, Ginger? You want in on this? Let's let's tag team them. Let's fucking hit them all yeah. together. All right. You guys ready? Let's go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> They're not breaking. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> <Look> you, Jeff. <Jack. laughs> They're not breaking. Fuck oh, you. Throw. <laughs> Throw a couple back. Hold on. Throw one back. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're not breaking. <laughs> Yo, those are great. They're not full Smash enough. Him up. Oh, get him in the nut. Oh. <laughs> uh, Ginger, give me some. <laughs> Yo, throw me one. Throw me one. <laughs> Ooh. Ah, oh, give me those. Mr. J. Ah. <laughs> oh. Get the ass. It's getting wet in here. Oh. Ah. You got to stop. Hurry, hurry. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> Look, that's my water broke. <laughs> Make him hold a pencil and stab him. Should have filled them with pee, John says. You got to hit them first. What kind of water balloons are these? <laughs> They're made out of recycled condoms. They you don't know what, Chad? It's all in great fun. You guys, all you have to do is share and like, and we smash them with I've water seen, balloons. I've seen condoms break easier. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo. But... <laughs> Put it in his pants and punch his ass. Punch his ass. Oh! Right in the butt crack. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. J's wet and wild tonight. Yeah, baby. Oh, wow. Uh-huh, <laughs> Mr. J, tell me about all your problems when you come sit back down. <laughs> oh, I gotta dry my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, chat, you guys prevailed. Well done. We got Mr. J wet and wild over here. Damn, man, you drip and you just get straight out the shower. <laughs> I bet hey. you his wife is jealous. Hey, boys, I'm wet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like She's like, how come he gets to get wet when I never get to get wet? <laughs> Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to close the show out tonight with a brand new segment called Mind in the Gutter. Oh. Okay, chat, we want you guys in on this one, too. 
after this, we are going to go to our final fan loyalty contest word of the night, okay? All right. It's only one more word next week to give away. So those who have stuck around, you guys are going to want to be a part of the last word what the, for the last week. Mr. J, the ginger, and Chris. Whoa! You guys ready? <laughs> <laughs> We're going to bring something up here called... Mind in the gutter, okay? <laughs> Excellent. It's funny you say it because Shannon says, this is so sexual. <laughs> 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 and my dad says he's very proud of me. Yeah. I'm <laughs> so that proud. There's got to be a first for everything. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Our friendship has prepared me for this segment. <laughs> yes. Excellent. Yes. Mind in the gutter. So exactly as it sounds, here's how it works, okay? We're going to go around the table. Mr. J, you're wet and wild. You can mm-hmm. start this one off, okay? okay? But I'm going to give you guys a frang, a saying, a couple of words, whatever it is. They may be dirty. They may be not. We're going to see where your mind's at and if it's in the gutter or not, okay? But what you have to do is tell me what you think it is, okay? Okay. All right. right. Mr. J, it's up to you to kick this one off. Mind Uh in the gutter. Chat, we want to know answers from you guys as well. See how dirty everyone is. Might be. It might not be. The first one is called Tease Hole. Tease hole. <laughs> what I think that is, eh? Um, what do you think a tease hole is, Mr. J? And let me know if your mind's in the uh, gutter. I think Jeez. it's another word for glory hole. Uh, no, it's for your finger. It's a finger hole. Oh, oh so yeah, through the stall. Yeah. What they suck your finger? <laughs> no, you, the, the chick puts her clit on it. You know? <laughs> it's like, oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I thought you were going to the proctologist for a minute. <laughs> Chat, we want to know, is this dirty or is it not? <laughs> if your proctologist says that to <laughs> you. <laughs> yeah, fuck. What I do mean, you guys think a tease, tease hole, hole is? Ginger, let's go across the table over to you. Tease hole is your mind in the gutter. It's a sex doll. It's got to be. Se- <laughs> oh, it's got to be. This is a Jugs Judy. Be. Yeah, it's a Jugs Judy. It's got to be. Yeah, it could be. Excuse me, can you tease my home? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go across the table. Our special guest tonight, Chris Amonpati. Mine's in the gutter or not? I'm what thinking, do you think tease hole is? I'm thinking this is a golf turn, like when like when your ball gets in, into the hole and then it just pops back oh, out. Like it teases. Oh, teases. Yeah, Holy it teases. shit. Like that is high IQ answer yeah, right baby. there. Fucking I'll right. give you in on that. I'll give Apparently you in on that. Apparently his mind's not in the gutter. Chat. Are we dirty or are we not? Oh, my God. So the what greatest answer is that Shannon Young says it's a fist. <laughs> what? <laughs> Trevor yeah, Dunn, is, Matt, Daddy's mom. Oh, 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 oh. you Trevor! Woo! <laughs> what a tease hole my mom is! Yeah. Wow. Uh, okay, and he, we got uh, Jonathan. It's so easy. Definitely, definitely not, not sexual. Patty D. Yeah. Her mouth. <laughs> <laughs> just her mouth. In yeah, just her yeah. mouth. Yeah. So tease hole is your mind in the gutter? Uh, a tease hole. Is actually the opening in a glassmaker's furnace through which the fuel is added. Oh, okay. oh. <laughs> <laughs> interesting. Yeah, so we're gonna say a couple of these. Some might be dirty, some might uh, not be. But. So straight up, somebody tried to fuck it. Yeah. Else, why would they call it a tease hole? <laughs> Excuse me. Could be. you add some fuel to my tease hole? <laughs> <laughs> Isabel says it's a hole in a fruit. <laughs> oh, oh yes. You picking watermelon or pumpkin? I was gonna say sure, watermelon. watermelon. Pumpkin. Watermelon. Yeah, pumpkins can have seeds, so you know. I don't know. It's stringy in yeah, there. Yeah, fuck seeds. Ooh. It's stringy. Yeah, yeah, it's stringy in there. Very. Yeah, I'm going sexual. watermelon too. Very teasy yeah. though. So good, good tangent. This is how <laughs> this is gonna go. Tease hole is number one. Whether your mind's in the gutter or not, might throw you off. We're gonna have to wait Ugh. and see. We're gonna go number two here. Everybody, do their best to guess what it is. Number two is dick, dick. Uh, <laughs> what, huh? Huh? what do you think what do you think dick dick is ginger let's go across the table over to you what's dick dick <laughs> oh my god what is, where's your mind at boys dick, dick. ginger's falling down oh, over fuck. here a dick dick uh <laughs> it's a sword fight oh <laughs> <Dang it>. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I like it. <laughs> dig, dig. Mine's in the gutter for yeah, sure. Yeah. I'm digging this. Let's go over to Chris. Mr. J, close this one out. Chris, what do you think a dick dick is? This is a fucking bird. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. It's got to be a Dude, fucking his bird. Answer, he's good. Yeah. <laughs> Say, are they dirty or are like, they not? There's like a We're bird called like a tit, out. so there's got to yeah. be one called a dick dick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's or the blue-footed booby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. The blue-footed. Yeah. Yeah. That's so, a bird. Yeah. So there's cacock and dick dick. He's like Pokemon? 
<laughs> that would be a Pokemon. You're right. a Pokemon. I choose you, Dick Dick. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta get go. Go. Use Harden. <laughs> Mr. J, let's go over to you. Chat, close this one out for us tonight. Dick Dick, we got two more to go, and then a sweet fan <sighs> loyalty contest coming up. Mr. J, what do you think Dick Dick means? I think it's when two dudes with the name Richard fuck. <laughs> <laughs> They're having a dick dick. Yeah, it's dick on dick, man. Yeah, I guess the short form is dick for Richard. <laughs> <laughs> They're having a dick dick. Yeah. All right, let's go over to chat. What do we got for uh, Dick Dick? Gary, Cheryl, O'Rourke, two dicks in the tease hole. Oh, <laughs> oh, Gary. Gary, your mind's not yeah. in the gutter by any means. Tyler, definitely a damn bird. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. we got a few people saying bird. Yeah, yep. I was going to say yeah. a bird. Oh, John says, I've heard this. Well, tell me. Oh, we got Definitely a, a bird. Trevor Dunn, yep. a little truck. Uh, John <laughs> Vanderheid, fuck fuck's brother. <laughs> Another term for docking. Oh, dude. Yeah. Shannon says a tiny little critter with a ridiculous face. Don't talk about my penis like that. <laughs> How many terms for docking do we need in this yeah, world? Yeah, no. We need uh, just one more. Dick, dick. You guys dick. are probably going to think I'm stupid. What's docking mean again? I forget what docking, docking means. Docking. Oh. The uncircumcised penis goes into the... Oh, yeah. like a space... Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, yeah. Okay. Docking. Yeah. I can visualize it. I got you. It's dude on... <laughs> Richard on Richard. Richard on Richard. <laughs> it's a dick, dick. It's a dick, dick. <laughs> okay, yeah. Literally a dick dick. Or is that Here a dog dog? Dick dick, uh, standing little more than a foot tall at the shoulder. The dick dick is one of the smallest antelopes in all of Africa. Oh, oh an antelope. antelope. It's an antelope. Fuck their you name, people who said bird. Their name Fuck. is apparently an imitation of their alarm call. Dude, all these is, people thought it was a fucking bird, too. So. I know. Yeah. Hey, chat, where are you guys at? How well do you know your antelopes? That's what a dick dick is. Dude, I love that fruit. It's my favorite fruit. Antelopes are great. <laughs> Let's go over to Chris. Uh, number three, do your best to guess. Mind in the gutter, my man. Number three is haboobs. <laughs> <laughs> what do you, come on, Chad, help uh, him out. Hub- what do you guys <laughs> think haboobs is? This is when you're like reaching in the dark trying to find him. And like, oh, where's haboobs at? Haboobs. <laughs> where's haboobs? Haboobs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so far the first two haven't been dirty maybe this one is we're gonna have to find out i bet the chat's gonna prevail on this one <laughs> mr j let's go over to you ginger close this one out what do you think haboobs is <laughs> i think it's uh the name for an, an egyptian dude <laughs> haboobs come here look at my pyramid it is giza haboobs Haboob. where's my Haboob. dick dick <laughs> haboobs look at my dick dick I don't even listen to Jewish accent. <laughs> I want to put my dick dick between the boobs. Yeah, yeah. You have a nice a boobs, a boob. You have a nice a boob. Ah, <laughs> uh, Jack, settle down. I'm not cheating. Oh, that. man. Let's go over to the ginger chat again. Close this one out with you guys. I want to know the best. What do you got? Mind in the gutter, a boobs. A guy named Habib with boobs. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Habib with that was his nickname. It's a boobs. <laughs> so chat killed it on this one. Woo, what do we got, chat? Oh man. So Jamie says the thing you say the first time you see boobs, like oh, boobs. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Shannon, yeah. That. Shannon Young says it's her middle name. <laughs> <laughs> Shannon Haboobs Young. Michelle Gabriel, what's going on? Yeah, what's uh, up, me- Michelle? Medical condition where you laugh when you see boobs. Man, Ooh, that was so laughs? genius. Yeah, Ooh. dude. Uh, Whoever you are, some Michelle, people got some crazy shit going on. We got. Uh, uh, Gary says Arabian knockers, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Isabel says a variety store owner. <laughs> Ooh, oh, where are you going? I'm going to have I'm going to boobs. <laughs> John says uh, someone who starts laughing at another man's man tits. Oh, oh okay, right. okay. Yeah, okay. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to the show. Haboobs is your mind in the gutter. I'll tell you what haboobs is, okay? Yeah. Mm. Haboobs are a dry wind that blows across deserts. <laughs> <laughs> Dust okay, bowls so and other arid regions there, often at great speed. So it has nothing to do with boobs. <laughs> yeah, but it does have to do with Egypt. It does. And, and lumps. <laughs> yeah, it has to do with Egypt. Sand dunes, yeah, you know? And yeah, Egypt, you know, wind. Sand. Yeah, no, it also I mean, says... I blow on boobs, so sand <laughs> dunes. Yeah. Just imagine being on the desert like, ah, the haboobs are very <laughs> severe today. <laughs> they say it's the very reason why tumbleweed blows. And it also says uh, it's variety store owners. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so is a We should go to rice. Like, is this haboobs? Yeah. Is this haboobs? <laughs> there any desert dunes around here? It's haboob around yeah, here. Yeah, so a haboob is a dry wind that blows across a desert. You know yeah. what yeah. moves tumbleweed? They call <laughs> you know, that was going to be my second answer. So, yeah. <laughs> Dick, dicks, tees, holds, and hoops. Oh, okay, fuck. we got one more here to go, and we're going to give out our last fan loyalty oh, word of word. The, the entire TWW 
series. So <sighs> we're going to go to the number four. You know what, my man? You can close this one out. All right. Chris Montpetit, everybody. Let's give it up for him. Chris, hey. we can close this one out right here, right now. We're playing a game called Mind in the Gutter. You got to tell me what this one's about, okay? Number four is called Dream Crack. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that's number oh, four. Geez. What do you guys say Dream Crack is? That's uh that's one like you like you're sleeping and like you feel like your your butthole's inchy and then you just <laughs> you're dreaming that you're like taking care of that itch. <laughs> dream crack. When you're sleeping and your butthole's itchy yeah. and you're dreaming of itching it. Okay. Chris, absolutely loving that answer. Ginger, let's go over to you. Mr. J, close this one mm. out. <laughs> Chat with you guys on top. Ginger, what do you got? Dream crack. Uh you're dreaming of cracks. <laughs> like yeah. just Cracks, <laughs> <laughs> like ass cracks, like just big ass old cracks, wall. big old ass cracks, just <laughs> the perfect dream crack. And then you wake up. Imagine like, a dream fuck. where you don't even see butt cheeks. It's only it's the all crack. cracks. Just the crack. <laughs> I don't know if I want just the crack. Well, I think no, I want the crack, but yeah. without the cheeks. Hey, where's my dick, dick, and my yeah. boobs? <laughs> Looking at that crack. Wow. Yeah, but that tease hole too, right? <laughs> you get the tease Those hole. The tease hole comes with the dream crack. The oh, tease hole is in the dream crack. Comes deal. together. Chat, Actually. what do you guys got? Final one. We're going to wrap up tonight's show with a fan loyalty contest. And then we got our rightful inductee. Chris is going to put his name on Jugs Judy. Mr. J, close this one out. What do you got for Dream Crack? This is stupid as hell, but it's the first thing I thought of. I think it's when a, a you know a dude purposely falls into some chick's butt cheeks while she, he's walking on the beach. Oh. You know, he's looking for his oh. Dream Crack. Oh. Dream oh, crack. And he found yeah. his Oh, dream I'm sorry. Crack. I found your Dream Crack. Yes. That's why. That's the first thing I thought of. The good old fashioned. Let's go to chat. We're doing a thing called Mind in the Gutter. So far, everything has been not dirty, but wow, yep. the answers have been nothing but, but that. Dirty. <laughs> yep. Absolutely. Somebody said a guy that only dreams of cracks. <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> can relate on that one as well. Can relate. Let's yep. go to chat. Close it out. Gary Cheryl will work. Right off the bat, I see Jennifer Lopez in there. <laughs> Woo! Oh, yeah. Jonathan, yeah. a TikTok life hack to make your dreams awesome. Hey, I like that one. Tyler, you're dreaming about suffocating from butt cracks. Oh, <laughs> the old butt cracks suffocate. Let's go. It hurts uh, so good. Shannon Young, day. when you sleepwalk to Haboob's corner store and eat all his candy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's called dream crack. <laughs> we'll go a couple more here. Isabel, it's like a dream catcher, but it's catching ass cracks instead of dreams. Oh. <laughs> well, just, I'm just trying to picture an ass crack without the cheeks. It's just, it's just like nah. a thin line with a butthole. <laughs> yeah, dude, and some hair. Man. <laughs> I'm just thinking of all these words. All these words, and you can... Visualize a person, right? <laughs> they got the tease hole. Yeah. They got the haboobs. Yeah. They got the dream crack. Yep. And they have the dick dick. <laughs> it's it's, it's just Judy. It's Jugs Judy. Yeah. Jugs. Yeah. <laughs> your dad says it's a porn star in your face moving her booty up and down. Oh, yeah. yeah the old yeah. dream crack. Yeah. Dream yeah. crack. Yep. Dad. Is mom sleeping right now? <laughs> He's like, is that why you're up? I'm going to go get me some dream crack right now. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to close it out with mind in the gutter. Basically, we'll, we'll spin this one back someday. Uh -huh. But, you know, they sound absolutely dirty. Are they? The last one was dream crack. A dream cat, crack, a dream cat, dream, dream cat. Dream cat. <laughs> <laughs> you dreaming crack or cock? <laughs> Fuck, I'm dreaming about dick dick and some haboos right now. <laughs> A dream crack is a small slit or opening made in the wall of a building to let in sunlight or fresh air. Oh, <laughs> oh okay. what the fuck? <laughs> okay, who fucked it? Yeah. Sounds like somebody a fucked me. It. Oh, somebody fucked it. Yeah, that fucked looks it. like the perfect crack right there. That is my dream crack. <laughs> That's my tease yeah. hole. The, no. con the contractor's like, you have a small crack here. The guy's oh, like, man. we should call it the dream crack. Yeah, yeah. When I read this one, I was dying. I was like thinking about it. I'm like, yeah, oh, babe, you know, like or you, you go to your, your your cousin's house or a friend's house. Be like, wow, you have a really nice dream crack. <laughs> oh. Is that a dream crack in your kitchen, girl? Yeah, the like, guy's like, damn. It's a window. No, nah, no, nah, that's a dream crack. You can't fool me. Yeah, you can put your nose to it and smell fresh air. Is it or my dream shit. crack or my tease hole? I can't tell. Let me get my dick dick. <laughs> Think about wall, everything you could say. Two Richards just start fucking. Yeah, that's right. uh, <laughs> damn, I want to put my dick dick in your dream crack. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> that is the end of our show, but we got the best parts coming up just for chat. You guys, it's our last week for our fan loyalty contest. Ooh. For those tuning in for the very first time, check this out. Behind me, you have a chance to win a bottle of Crown Royal and a $50 Amazon gift card right there. Okay? How you do it is you have to submit words on our website every show since episode eight We've given away a word, okay? 
If it's your first time tuning in, go back, watch those shows, put in those words. Every submission you put in our website gets you another chance at winning that prize. Next week, we're doing the draw. Okay, we're going to do a spin wheel live. You have to be present on the show. If you're not, we're going to spin it again. Somebody else is going to win. Tonight's word, go to our website at twwshow.net slash submit and put in the word kahunas. Ah, yes. <laughs> All right. Ah, put in the word yeah. kahunas tonight. Woo. There's some big kahunas. Twwshow.net slash submit. The more words you submit, the more chances you have at winning. Next week, we're going to do the draw. Me, Ginger, and Mr. J, the TWW crew, is going to personally drive to your house and give you the prize of oh, a big bottle yeah. of Crown Royal and a $50 Amazon gift card. It's all yours. Yeah, we are. If you want a chance to win, TWWshow.net, this week is the last week. Kahuna's is the last word, okay? Make sure you get it in. Mr. J. I got to ask, what was the story behind you grabbing these balls? Where is this? Oh, yeah. Where did you find these big old balls? Uh, so this was a uh, part of the uh, uh, RM's 40th anniversary, and there was uh, some uh, elephants that they had that are part of like the world fair yeah. from like the 1930s, and they're like mechanical elephants, and they with they put real the balls. balls. They put the balls. <laughs> real balls. They're, Those are elephant balls. I'm Those a real boy. Balls. Yeah, <laughs> we must pay extreme attention to detail and put the <laughs> testicles in there. Elephantitis. Hey, the balls are but the best, head. man. There you have it. Uh, who's got some big kahunas out there that's going to go to our website and yeah. put this word in? Let's bring that up again. More yeah. opportunity to win, more chances, the more words you submit. If you haven't went back, go now. Put in those words because next week we are going to do the draw. We're going to do it yep. live. You have to be present. So keep that in mind. You're not going to want to miss we episode 20. We've got a big guest coming on as well. Tonight, Chris, you absolutely killed it. Let's give this guy a fucking big round of applause. Woo! Chris on the team, me. baby. Yeah, you you killed it. It. He's going to do us all a soul, and he's going to put his name on Jugs Judy. Sign where you please, my uh, man. Her hair's fake, apparently. No. <laughs> do you want front or back? Uh, let's, let's, go, uh, let's go back. Okay. To the back. Oh. Jugs with the fake tits. Beautiful. Watch Funny, your faces, everybody. She's a fake doll, but she has fake tits. I don't know what <laughs> She needs an arm tag. I always seem to get her foot in my face. It's all right. Oh. Ladies and That's gentlemen, your fetish. for those watching out there, give a big shout out to Chris. Also, Heather, thanks for the content tonight. You guys rock. If you guys want to be on the show, please let us know. Reach out to us on all our social media platforms. Anything else, TWWshow.net. Again, get your words in. Tonight's the last night. Next week, we give away the prize, and we're going to show up at your doorstep. Ladies and gentlemen, we are time well wasted. Let's give a big cheers and shout out to Chris Moffat. Chris, we killed it. Yeah, you did Appreciate good. Appreciate it, guys. 8 Thanks o'clock for having me. next week. We'll see you guys then. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yes. baby. We're, Who we're wants to play with my dick, dick? You did her on her, on her arm? Yeah, I gave her arm tat. <laughs> yeah, you did her arm, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Thank you for watching the Time Well Wasted show. If you'd like to see more, check us out at TWWshow.net. And we'll see you next time, bitches. Wow, what a stupid show. I can't believe people actually watch this crap. Ah, thank God I don't have to look at those faces anymore. <gasps> Wait a minute. Without a TV, how am I supposed to look at porn now? Ah, I'll just use my computer. All right, just gotta log in. Huh? What the hell is this? The official Time Well Wasted website, where you can watch episodes, learn about the crew, and even submit your own content to be featured on the show. And what's this? A bunch of links to all the Time Well Wasted social media pages? Wow, that's so interesting. Like, I give a shit. Fuck this website. New search. You got mail. What the? Ah. It's that Nigerian prince again. What the hell does he want? Uh, hi, Jimmy. Are your friend Robert Deep in there? Click the link and I'll give you three million monies. Okay, I'll click that. I could use three million monies. <laughs> ah, for crying out sakes, that's the third time this week. You know what? Fuck you, computer. I'm peacing out. I got some coupons for Taco Bell. Hang on.